Hey everybody, Carolina Tony coming to you today from Fontenelle. This was Barbara Mandrell's mansion. Uh, she's moved away a long time ago, but this house is here on tour. It's got a lot of neat stuff in it, a lot of things that belong to her, a lot of things that belong to some other country and western or country music stars. Really neat place. And we're going to take a look at all of it but right after this station identification. Three Bears here at Fontenelle that had a special meeting for Barbara Mandrell. And here's the back side of the mansion. Really cool. And it's raining like crazy. Yeah. Hey guys, this is Buck Owens' guitar. And he actually used this guitar in his TV show, He Hop. Way out of tune. Got a bust of string too. Let's go look around. Okay, this guy's guitar right here was Chris Daltrey from Greensboro, North Carolina. Was on American Idol. How about that? This staircase here in Fontenelle is a it's called a double helix staircase it's not actually a spiral spiral staircase because the spiral staircase has got a center support this here supports itself and there's only one other in the whole world and this is made from mahogany okay. six bedrooms total in the house. But 13 bathrooms. Uh, this is a That's really what it is. And that's what they built it for. Believe it or not, this was practical. Oh, that, that, that was great balls. It was my rendition. Of it. <laughs> so, this and we'll so, so Jerry Lee Lewis broke that, huh? Yeah, that would have been his... I'm sure that's why they retired him. Okay, guys, this fella right here, our tour guy, his name is Seth. Look at him. One day, he's going to be like really right. famous. You can see this mug up in the light. That's right. He's going to be on. Big, he's yeah. going to be on album cover. You just wait. Here we go. <laughs> this here is the largest log home in North America. At one time, it was the largest log home in the world. This is the formal dining room. Both. Yeah, they had a private chef. Funny enough. Oh yeah, a little higher pitch, I think. <laughs> if I remember right. Uh, and Sarah Cannon was her real name, Sarah Ophelia Cannon, and uh, she was a good friend of Barbara's, and so she was an ever present. Anytime they had guests, uh, Sarah was always here. She said all the way down the left. That was her her purse there. And their routine. Butter, butler's pantry. It's fire rated, so this house couldn't burn down either. And that's a pretty big. Mm -hmm. In fact, there are companies that make a pretty decent amount of money. They buy a burned down log. Uh, this is, I haven't said it yet. I've got it. I only said foreign things. Until you got it. Um, Alabama real good. I love this. E even big Alabama fans generally don't know how big Alabama really is. Uh, not only are they the biggest country fan of all time. This was the kids' lounge. This is where this was where the kids 
bedrooms were. Some clothing from Dottie West and Louise Mandrell and Tricia Yearwood and Kitty Wells. Back in the back, Connie Davis, Jean Shepard, and Lori Morgan, and Holly Dunn. Lori White, Naomi Judd, Tammy Wynette, and Pam Tillis, and Dottie Rambo. Here's another one of the kids' bedrooms. A nice closet there. Big old bed. Let's go in the shower here. A toilet and a walk-in shower. Not a whole lot of headroom. Oh, get on the Tony. They have turned one of these bedrooms into the Crystal Gale bedroom. Crystal Gale. A quick shot of her on the TV. All these fancy performing performance gowns. Here is one of the two guest bedrooms. Here's the other guest bedroom. This house is like 33,000 square foot. Only has two guest bedrooms and they share a bath. Here in Barbara Mandrell's house, this is the root beer bar. That's what it really was. And all of the uh, family members had their own neon sign Carrie, Barbara, Fountain Fontaine, Fontanelle, Fountain Fontanelle, I'm sorry. Matt, James, and Nathan. Here's this big room, a view from my head, overhead. This is Captain This was Barbara Brandrell's master bedroom. Not really. One time, Booking.com made this a hotel when the Eclipse came through last year. This is one of the best. First room we've been where they lived at all. This is it. This is, they, here, the kitchen. That was it. That's Italian for a marble, the fireplace. Yep. Your typical log on a marble fireplace. <laughs> and uh, that too, it, originally all this upholstery was white uh, to match the. This bed. Check this out. Now we're leaving the bedroom, going to the walk-in closet, down the hall. Look at this walk-in closet. Here's the view from the closet. There's a nice stream running below on the mountainside. With all these cabinets. Marble bathtub. And folks, that toilet right there, Barbara Mandrell sat on that toilet. Ooh, I gotta touch it. Only Carolina Tony will show you that. Okay, here is the kitchen. So this was the family gathering place. 
30 years of traffic, not one of those little leaves is blown off. Pretty impressive. These three bears that are on this log, they were not carved and put there. They were carved onto this log. So the man that carved it, he started on it, and then he got disappeared for a while and couldn't find he was in jail, so they bailed him out on a work release program so he could finish. It's a covering over a pool that's still got water in it, but they don't use it as a pool anymore. So we're walking over the pool. Kind of cool. Now here is the pool kitchen. And here is the Mandrell firing range. <laughs> Brought you guys up here and work or? Yeah, yeah. Uh, just work. We're from Atlanta up here. Yeah. Oh, cool. Okay, I'm gonna close for now. Hope you enjoyed our visit to Fontenelle and Bob of Mandrell's Mansion. It's really been neat. I want to thank you for stopping by my channel. If you haven't subscribed, be sure to go down here and click subscribe. After that, ring the bell so be notified every time we put a video out. And again, I want to thank you. But most of all, y'all have a good day.